All right, so we're going <clears> to <throat> quickly look at a sample uh, if formula in Salesforce, an if statement um, to label a checkbox field true or false. Um, so the field that we're going to use here is number of locations. Uh, and we're just, you know, this is a standard or not a standard number field. It's a custom number field on uh, the lead object. So if I come over to the new custom field that I'm building, uh, I'm going to start with this if statement. Similar to the other uh, video that I created on cases, I recommend starting on advanced formula. If you're new with functions, if you're not familiar with this from Excel or anything like that, it's a good place to um, just get started. So if I come down here and say if, you can see that there's a logical test, value of true, value if false. Um, so a logical test is going to test to see um, if something is, it, it's the expression or the formula that you're building and there's going to be a true value and a false value. So I want to label, uh, I have a checkbox field that's labeled corporate lead. Now, if the lump number of locations is greater than five, I want that to be checked true. If it's not, I want it to be checked false. So my logical test is number of locations is greater than five. Value if true is true and the value if false is false. Um, you know, pretty straightforward example here since I'm using a checkbox. Come down here, I can check the syntax. You can see that everything checks out. Um, one thing to note here is you can have kind of multiple if statements. I'll make a separate video um, on that one, maybe kind of chaining some of these things together. Uh, but it's just a pretty uh, simple example of how to use an if statement to build a field.